What's going on, everybody? Hopefully, you guys had a good weekend. We're already should be in the work week when this post out. I wanted to uh, go over something somebody sent to me on eBay. And yeah, there's more fake slabs. I don't want to say they're fake slabs, but I'll show you guys the listing. Let me pull that up here real quick. So, 29 empty PSA style professional and steel graded uh, slabs. So they're out there, but they don't have the PSA logo down here. Let me see if I can pull it to show you. See, there's no PSA logo down here onto it. So it's just another tool that's out there. These, these are sold out, thankfully. <laughs> but um, that, you know, people could be using to either put their own personal stuff in, build their own labels up just to protect them which would be the intent that I would hope is being used for and not for somebody to try to generate a fake PSA label out there. And I know people are good at photocopying and Photoshop or whatever it's called out there. So just be careful, guys, with the stuff you're buying out there. In no way am I calling this like a scam or anything like that, but I just don't like the wording onto it. PSA style professional unsealed graded slab. Um... They look and feel exactly like a PSA slab, but they're not. You know, it to me, it's just, you know, one of those things where somebody's trying to sell their stuff, and I don't think it's a good thing. You should just say it's empty graded slabs that you could use. You know, I wouldn't even use the word PSA onto it because everything that's been going on the last few months, this is stuff you will not want to put on stuff like this because you could really, really get yourself in some trouble out there. Um, it tells you to seal these, you will need ultrasonic water and some type of bonding agent or acrylic glue, all that stuff there. But just to bring some awareness out there, stuff still floating out there. Be careful, I mean, with what you're buying off the internet or the show. Always make sure you guys are checking the BGS slabs. There should be that dot in there. Uh, for PSA, they should have the PSA piece. It's in the bottom right-hand corner into their case. Um, but this is just good information to put out there, buddy. It's not a real long video, but it's just something I just want to show everybody somebody sent to me. And I, I thought it would be something good to put out there because we've seen this stuff floating around um, on Macari and eBay and everywhere else out there. It's just one of those things where I personally do not agree with the way it's labeled here as PSA style and talking that. You shouldn't even put that in your titles. If you're going to sell these things, you just put down, you know, unsealed graded card slab or whatever you might want to do. Because when you start labeling it as other people's stuff, you can really get yourself in a heap of trouble onto that. Especially, you know, PSA is a huge company underneath Collector's Universe. They can really uh, come after somebody just for even saying probably using that in there. I don't know. I'm not a lawyer. I just know it draws bad unwanted attention to the hobby and to... The people, it's all part of it. But let me know what you guys think on to it. I mean, I personally don't mind if somebody's going to do their own slabbing and stuff like that there to protect their cards. You know, hey, you put your own grade on whatever you think, too. Everybody's a grader nowadays, to be honest. Uh, there's all kind of companies popping up every which way. There's not like a school to go to for grading unless you're going to the bigger companies where they train graders and stuff like that there. But, you know, me, I'll just wait time out and have it come back, you know, from one of the top two companies out there. Um, a lot of all the other companies are just not to where I would actually want to spend money into the company and have them slab my cards at this time. But, all right, everybody, have a good week. I will see you all live next Friday, next Friday, because this weekend will be Easter, the following Friday with an auction. Hopefully some PSA comes in by then, because uh, most of my cards are really high, and I don't want to start auctions off at like five, six dollars $600 and stuff like that. So we'll see what happens. Take care, have a good week, and I'll see you all later.